could never happen to them. Women who traded in their old cell phones only to discover someone stole their most private pictures and their videos. Well, tonight, Taking Action reporter Jackie Calloway is showing you how this happened and why it is not an isolated incident. Jackie? These women say they trusted big name cell phone retailers to transfer data from their old cell to their new upgraded phones, and it's a mistake they fear will haunt them for years. In one case, a couple visited a T-Mobile store where they traded in a cell phone for an upgrade. Yeah, I'm like, who did you send this video to? And he's like, what video? And I'm freaking out, like, oh my God. Hours later, they discovered someone transferred an intimate video from their mobile to a stranger's phone. I feel extremely exposed and, and vulnerable. Tampa attorney John Brewer says it's one of three similar cases involving employees at different cell stores in recent months. We don't know where these photographs, in some cases, or videos have gone. Joanne, who lives in Largo, says an employee at this Sprint store stole 22 nude pictures off her old cell phone last November. What was your assumption that they would do with the old phone and the material on it? Delete everything and then put it away. Very violated and scared. I don't know where these pictures are going to go, who's going to see them later on in life. Tonight at 11, you're going to hear more from these women, what happened in each case, and also we're going after answers, asking the cell phone companies what are they doing to safeguard their customers' data. Laura?